Hey, what's up? I'm Al Cox. I make games, play games, and everything in between. And today we are checking out Zuburon. All right, Zuburon just came out very recently. This sword looking character, I think, is the spaceship that you start out with. I like how the words are all crossed out. It seems to be a common theme. And here we got the start button with the cool looking A. It's getting bigger and smaller, so let's just go ahead and jump into it. Okay, so here's the dude. I'm not sure I'm supposed to just be getting all of these. Okay. Cool particles in the background. It looks like a lot of the objects are spinning after I go by them. Very easy control. I'm not sure. Okay, that was cool. So those were wake up spawners. It almost looks like, not like dust particles. I just wish I knew what the colors meant. Ah, uh, this is super. Ah, oh, that's a cool restart button. Two fifty five is my high score. Okay. So the main thing, I'm not sure what my objective is. The graphics are cool, the particles in the background are very cool. So I'm just gonna have to guess my goal is to just get all the objects and not die. I, uh, hold on, I'm not sure, okay. Oh, wait, so something doesn't kill me. Really? Uh, so, but that one does kill me? So the smaller objects don't kill you, but the bigger ones do kill you. Okay, so that was a bigger one. I just I just wasn't sure. I don't know if you can see, but the blue and white particles flying through the air just kind of adds like momentum and speed for the character. Which I feel like it's a flying sword. That one was kind of invisible, so I'm not sure like how that works. Like, I definitely don't want to touch it because I do believe I'll die. Oh, that was interesting. Let's see what it goes up over here. Oh, and now it's... Ah, so it comes from the left and now it's following. Oh, shit. Oh, so that was like copying, duplicating the character. Ah. Looks like possibly always oh, starting the same beginning few levels. Again, I'm not crystal clear on the different color coins. Something's got to open it up. Oh, barely. That barely made it. Okay, so there's just like a portal jump. Ah, oh, but it, then it jumps me into a bad area where I die, that's not cool. I don't appreciate that. Okay, so there's a wake up spawn that's causing the enemies to rotate once my character gets within a X amount of distance. This is cool. Oh, you know what? That's weird. It just disappeared. So that was the thing that happened. I do wish there was some information about the colors. Maybe I missed it. Maybe there's like a tutorial I'm supposed to. All co colors don't matter. They do matter. See, this is very difficult. You see this tightness on that? That's a, I think that's the second time I died there. Probably just got to go a lot slower. Utilize the maneuverability of the whole screen. Man, those particles are cool. Particles like that is there's multiple ways you can set it up. I would, I mean, honestly, it might not even be a particle. Oh shit! Oh come on, come on, come on, come on! Don't die! 
it might not even be a particle. It could just be simple images that are causing. Oh shit. Ah, uh, it happens so quickly, and there's like no notification that it's about to happen. Where you get cloned characters. I guess the best way right now is to just know that specific scene area of where it happens. It's cool. There's like light sources. This is gonna teleport me. Oh. Okay, cool. I'm in another world. And you can see that there's a different flying p dust particle. Oh, shit. That's kind of cool. It just looks weird. All right, keep getting this tight. Oh, I don't like being on the left. Oh man, that was cool. Check it out, Zubulon, links down below. Let me know what your high score is. And if you got a game built by Buildbox, please let me know because I'm always looking for games to play. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you next time.